Good morning, good morning everyone. We are back with our sweets from DIY Choose, those yummy, yummy, delicious donuts. And for today, my friend and I, we choose, well, <laughs> kindly, she decided that uh, she wants me to choose a color. Thank you, my friend from Germany. So I picked these two colors for today, which is first color will go on this blue glazed donut, whatever that is. And the light color is going to be those little white lines, which you will see them more or here or actually in here on a top donut, this uh, straight lines vertical. So maybe we will finish this one first, then we'll go after this one. So last time we did our two colors, that was a homework to create two colors and they were both kind of like a dark in um, dark brown colors. So I did that, that was a W and D symbols. No, 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 not D, B, uh, W and B. Today we will have a symbol D and a line. Uh, there's supposed to be one more friend. Uh, she said she has a stash somewhere, this canvas. So maybe it's going to be three of us today. Anybody else wanna join with this diamond painting, please? Uh, comment below who else have this yummy delicious canvas so we can work together. I will bring you as close as possible. I think this is the best so far that I can bring you really close to the canvas. And I will show you, I already prepared on a tray my first diamonds. Okay, diamonds gorgeous. So let's place. Uh, I think maybe today even I put in my plan to finish these two colors, but to me maybe it's going to be like not enough to be working only on two colors till next time. Maybe on the end of this video we will pick together another symbols to finish just so we can go a little bit like faster to finish. Even I do have lots of different canvases to work on and uh, last night I started on my another canvas and plastic cross stitching of my mushroom and as I said I wanted to start on a big canvas and if I start on a big canvas then my mushrooms probably will be never finished so I want to finish them first before I start to go after bigger one like a, an Aida or up there like a um, 25 or 27 count I can't remember right now but um, yeah so we will work on this one and depends how much color and looking at right now I'm looking right now there's not too many symbols of D in here and if you hear the noises my puppy playing with this new toy oh my god that was a funny story if you are up for a funny story now she's playing with the long curled up snake that we got for kids when we were like going used to to the fair every summer and kids would uh, play some games to collect the soft toys from the park right so i have like a bucket of them so now time from time we just give them to puppies to play but before that snake she went to Catherine's bedroom and she stole her flamingo that was present to uh, as a present to Catherine. It was a big, big, huge flamingo. And she walking with the flamingo, the flamingo bigger than Daisy. Oh my god. And I thought, what is this clacking, making funky noises on the floor? And that was flamingo big eyes. You know those beautiful toys that have a beautiful glittery eyes? Well, that that's kind of flamingo. And she is scaring proudly to get this to her cage. Oh, when I saw that, I knew Catherine not gonna be happy because that was uh, her one of the favorite 
toy that she sometimes display, put on a bed, whatever. Plus, that was a present. And yeah, <laughs> so Daisy, a thief, she stole Flamingo. So we decided to get some alternative. We decided she got tired of all the older toys. So we have to give her something new. So now she has a snake and they sometimes wrestle and hey Daisy, you have a snake? <laughs> so she just walking with that snake all over her house and going in her cage and out. So yes, if you hear any noises, I cannot find a very very peaceful time to like body right now sleeping next to me. So hopefully she will settle down as well. For this canvas, I originally wanted to go for a very, very bright turquoise color in here. And I almost picked that color, but then I decided it's a beautiful big patch in here. And I can stay like, you know, on one place with camera a little bit longer because the gorgeous turquoise color and my friends who have this canvas I can tell you which one color I'm talking about it's a 24 number it's the last symbol S actually and this next donut we have this color so maybe we will pick that one for the homework no I would love to be in the camera with that color okay I don't know yet I don't know yet what I will do, but I want to finish a little bit sooner this canvas. So I pick more. I need to pick more than just the two colors, to be honest. Uh, now, some of you was asking me. Just a minute, I'm gonna sip coffee. Many of you waiting for the canvas uh, that uh, Catherine and I we did you know the trucks well last night because we took some kind of like a you know because I have to do much more reviews and kind of keep a progress on many more companies so we kind of put it a little bit kind of on hold and she was doing some other stuff uh, other diamond painting so finally Yesterday she des uh, she decided she wants to finish and she did. So yes, she beat me. She finished first. So now I have left only just a very colorful diamonds. So I will be working with you in a few colors together and then I will finish it. So that video will come up soon, but surprisingly, canvas looks really good actually. So that video will come up, I think, probably for them. Sorry, Papa just keep running back and forth. Daisy, go lay down. Go lay down. Um, this week, pretty much everything is scheduled for me in here. My uh, calendar is full for the week so I think I will upload the video for next week and I have a few more uh, unboxing to do so hopefully I can do that before camping doesn't looks like it's uh, it feels like it's going to be rain today and it was supposed to be rainy and cold all weekend, so I don't know. Not sure yet. If I will go on camping this weekend or not, because if it's raining every day, I don't want to stuck in a trailer for all two, three days with no internet. And of course, I can craft, but I mean. If it's raining, just stay in, uh, inside of the trailer with dogs. It's not much fun for them, nowhere to run. And outdoors, when it's raining, it's too muddy, would be. 
and then later you have to bring them inside of the trailer and you know the stinky dog smell when it's wet Daisy you're really noisy today I don't know I might have to stop video a little bit till she fall asleep because she has this lately chewing on a cage oh. Daisy stop <laughs> all right this is totally distraction distraction anyway look at these beautiful diamonds let's pay attention on the beautiful diamonds this is third color so far and diamonds are gorgeous no they are all gorgeous in this canvas so if this canvas is still in store I would highly recommend if you like the sweets you can put in your like maybe um, kitchen or di by dining table um, if you like to bake that would be awesome picture to represent your hobby I think it's beautiful so how many how many of us working today on this donuts this beautiful blue glaze not sure what kind of donut that is my plan was to actually bring it today a box of donuts and tease you but that would be not nice right I just didn't want to go to Tim Hortons which is five minutes away to walk to Tim Hortons it's literally like almost on the end of my street not far away yeah maybe like five minutes walk and I would be at Tim Hortons maybe on the end of diamond painting when we will be close to finishing this canvas maybe I will bring a box of donuts just to to see if we can find something similar on our canvas but I promise I'm not gonna try to make you hungry purposely we're just gonna compare diamond painting donuts and fresh donuts okay a little bit the center of the canvas I mean this is the top that I showed you we have in here next our target so maybe this is will be next one You know what else I was working last night on? I put lots of beads. Remember my little college, little canvas cottage, beautiful house. I kind of neglected and put away for a long time. And finally I decided that I will finish. So I was working, well, maybe to to be honest, my night last night was sleepless. I was crafting like to 3 or maybe even 4 o'clock in the morning. So I put lots of diamonds in there. I will show you in one of the videos. Maybe we will create one video with that cottage and finish together. There. Now, okay, there's a few diamonds of this color, a little bit more deep into the canvas right in here. Yeah, so my dear friend, Heidi, I think that's, if I pronounce your name, um, yeah, maybe we will do more colors today. Because we have to finish more colors and I hope you work on something else in between if you want to keep doing together or you want to finish sooner because 
I have to kind of time from time, well not time from time, definitely I need to post every day something different so I can't really work on this canvas every single day to finish but uh, I we will do a little bit of the homework as well to finish canvas faster. I don't know what are we created now, like a sprinkles maybe? <coughs> Excuse me. Coffee time. Okay. Moving on, moving on a little bit more to the left of the canvas. And I just put the puppy for... It is fun to know that somebody else with you working on the same canvas. Seriously, I feel like we are teaming here. Even you are far away across the ocean. I'm still like, a, I feel like I know you forever. You are my friend that I never met in my life, but I will treasure our friendship forever. all the way from Germany when I was at school Germany was international language that I learned in my school so I can tell you guten tag it's mean good day I don't remember much to be honest, just a few like, you know, Guten Tag, Auf Wiedersehen, Achten, well, no, I remember lots of words, but to put them into the sentences, it's going to be challenging. I know how to count. So we're working on the top of the canvas for now. And then one more donut we will touch of, of in here like, oh look at this yummy picture in here. And uh, I, I always do, here is a little tip for you, see I have a DIY chosen here, I put with my Sharpie just to remember where from my canvas because lots of companies have the same diamond paintings and I want to make sure I give a credit to the proper website who sent me this canvas. So after this corner we will move to our next color because we have lots even right underneath of this one donut we have target for our next color so that's what we are going to start probably in this corner and I can't believe we are already in 18 minutes recording time flies so fast and I'm having a fun I almost ordered the other day again one of the canvas that have kind of sweets but now I have to wait um, because I know I already ordered somewhere something kind of cookie or more donuts something sweets but I cannot remember from where 
So I have to wait that package first if it ever will arrive. And uh, because sometimes I can order like a, you know, duplicate by forgetting that I already have. So here it is. Uh, we are going to put away now our diamonds and switch to our lighter color because we have a big patch in here kind of a little bit more of this color in here so let's switch to number 20 now number 20 and that is one of my favorite colors because it's such a kind of uh, how, how could I say this color Gent no not gentle um, pastel uh, I don't know it just such a beautiful color like a very very light mint kinda love this color and look at this we have in here okay I have a coffee next to me and I always say put coffee far away so that's what I'm gonna do right now put my coffee far away okay look at this donut we have lots of of this symbol in here that we can work there and I think it's a perfect for you you right now in a full screen all right so next symbol this one stripes in here and pretty much this color is very popular for many many canvases for the background remember my white roses canvas the gorgeous one huge canvas it was lots of background in this color and I did not mind because I love this color so much if this would be black it would probably more kind of like tiring but because this is so airy and feels like like a cloud I don't know this color is so light and cloudy to me I cannot explain but I have some special attachment to this color without knowing why so let's play some game and chit chat in the comment section what is your favorite color and we will talk about color uh, sometimes let's say not for the clothes but like in general maybe some kind of combination color because when I grew up I guess well back then didn't have too many like a bright and neon colors like right now pretty much was everything was kind of <laughs> sad colors it's yeah colorful but sad colors not as bright so my favorite color was always uh, baby pink and baby blue I don't know representing boy and girl maybe no idea like you know babies but then when I was card making for six or seven years you most of you saw my card collection that I created with digital images or stamps if you didn't I do have a playlist um, What's the playlist name? Uh, card? No. Paper. Yeah, that was a playlist paper craft. You can see how many cards I make. I make like there are uh, five or six videos. That's how many cards I had to showcase. So when I start to make a cards, um, I discover that I love combination of turquoise kind of like a mint color and brown and when I created card for the first time with this unusual for me colors I fell in love with these two colors because well for example even in here right now brown and turquoise kind of a mint color but it, this one is too bright a little bit um, most likely this is what we color like you know the, the, this kind of in here maybe something in brown in the combination whatever you're doing it looks really good together so now I have kind of my colors 
favorites change I still like blue and pink but the, also there's so many beautiful colors that now I like this mint color new turquoise I like this bright neon orange for example and there's so many like even green never was my favorite color but some of the greens are so special that it really kind of like a new shade of color that was developed and um, now we have more and more often them have received with diamond painting which is few years back that color did not exist in diamonds so yeah we're doing a progress so what is your favorite colors I know many have favorite colors as a purple which is also beautiful color well I like every color to be honest but there's always something favorite for everybody so yeah please comment let me know your favorite color or one or maybe color combination just for fun there I have few questions, uh, messages I have on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, yeah, if you are on Twitter, I'm not very much of the Twitter, but I do share my video to Twitter. Sometimes I retweet some tweets, but for me, Instagram the most kind of active. But I did receive a message on Twitter about cross stitching, so I will have to create some video and collect all those questions because it's sometimes difficult to explain um, by writing. It's well more effective if I can show and explain. So I will choose some canvas not sure from which company and which canvas I want to do tutorial on so that will be also probably next week this week run for me a little bit faster because of the long weekend in Canada so Monday was kind of off and we were at the campground and now I'm totally messed up I feel like I'm missing a one day of the week so yeah I have to get back to normal next week it will be it feels normal this time feels like it's flying by so fast and and I already pre-recorded videos and if I want to record another video then I wouldn't have a free day to upload like unless I would do second video per day which lots of you don't mind to have two video a day <laughs> if I want something really really sh showcase and urgent kind of to talk to you about nothing really just to chit chat and I don't know I just love to have company because I don't know I'm like you lonely you know nowhere to go and you want to have some you know more than just your family you want to talk to somebody and right now even my poor BFF she's also right now can't too often come to me unfortunately she lost her mom a few days ago she's my admin on Facebook group so we'll, we'll pray for her healing it's difficult time for her right now so that's why I kinda when I talk to you I feel completed I feel like you know I just been in my 
girlfriend's house and we chit chat and now time to go home so you changed my life to a happy place even you think I keep a new company you are keeping me company we keep each other we keep each other creative I can imagine people who don't have any hobbies and don't do any crafts it's probably really really lonely to be like this so for us who love craft this lockdown doesn't really affect in us because we are creative we keep ourselves busy and that is awesome because we have so much to do all those diamonds to put down sometimes when I look on those pack of diamonds just for one canvas it's like oh my god how many I already placed them so there we already created this one no sun whatsoever outside so we're not going to see any sparkles unless I will put artificial light now let's move um, to a little bit more there's another donut in here right on the top of the canvas let me just move my tray away and spread it out diamonds I did some gardening yesterday well actually not really garden but just a mulch did not plant flowers yet let's finish this one first kind of not too many diamonds in here but let's just build our donuts from the top Some of you say, by seeing all these donuts, you just want to go to the Martins and get one. Why don't you bake some cupcake? That would be cheaper and much more you can bake one batch especially right now just grab a box like in here in Canada everything in the boxes right in Ukraine we're making everything from scratch in here you open box add few ingredients and boom cake or cupcakes whatever you decide to make it's ready by the way about sweets yes we are going to make some sweets for my cooking channel I already prepare but all the ingredients left at the camper because I did not have time to do that first week was very busy but we will do the camping style treats your kids will love them I promise you so it was it's going to be very fast but yummy so Catherine and I we will do together we will put camera somewhere on a table up there hopefully puppy not gonna knock it down and we will create the sweets because we all love sweets and we're working with sweets that's what made me think of that because we are working with sweets okay so this is like a white sprinkles this is a little bit like a confetti you see like a whole bunch of different colors in here on the top so when we place them all, it's going to be so beautiful. Oh. I'm really looking forward to finish this canvas sooner. And now we have a big patch right in here. So let's work on it. And my lovely ladies and gentlemen, if you don't have this canvas, I hope you're working on something, making a progress that you already started a long time ago. And work on something together with us, maybe even cross stitching. I 
want to say hello to one of my viewer who said my voice are so soothing then she watched my video before bed does she fall asleep <laughs> and I'm thinking hmm should I sing a lullaby that would definitely suit your dreams down but that would be hmm I don't know lullabies you know how I sing lullabies for my kids well I did have one a lullaby but um, that was in very popular lullaby but in Russian language in Ukrainian if I would do a lullaby I would make it up my own story <laughs> I love to do that to sing about everything about nothing really that's what I call it about everything and about nothing I make up my own story and they love it when they say okay mom when they were little right tell us some story like or fairy tale whatever it is so I would lay down on a bed in the middle kids on two of my hands on each side we snuggle together and I would tell them a story make up story making it funny they would giggle and without like preparing whatever gets in my mind oh my god they would love that they would love that so my story never was repeated one time Catherine loved that story so much that she asked me to tell her the same story next day and you know what when I was thinking about the story that story was came out so good that would be perfect little book for kids yeah in my young age I practice used to, to write a poem and I I did few cannot remember them anymore one time I write down a letter to my family like on three pages I think in poem everything in poem so too bad I did not save it for myself copy because that was interesting to write down everything you know how you live here in Canada but everything rhymes that was fun took me time but it was fun I like to be creative my niece actually she is a good writer she um, uh, she has her stories poems or even like a kid story they were uh, printed in a book yeah they kind of like a few young artists authors uh, created from like a local area and they um, have a book and that was awesome so I guess we have some talents running in the family and she is very very crafty she create whole bunch of uh, stuff like from from coffee beans she making the pictures from any kind of seeds from coins money to create in a money tree oh my god she's so creative she better than I I always tell her you have to come live with me you know how much we can create together yeah her name same as mine and when we were when she was a baby we call each other sisters not niece and aunt no she's a daughter of my oldest sister we call each other sisters so basically I raised her and my little sister. They were following me like a little tails. 
because between my younger sister and my niece they were two years difference so they were like little sisters right and because um, my sister divorced in young age when uh, my niece was just a baby they moved back to my mom's house so she didn't know her father so she called father my dad she she knew it's a grandpa but because we all call dad that she thought it's a normal thing to call my father as a dad so yes we grew up like sisters I love her to bits one more here we done with this one so let's uh, move a little bit more to this side just to clean up kind of top of the canvas here and there one in here oopsie lost my bead sometimes not sticking and one here and then more right on the top in here So we need to create some kind of homework because I think this video now link pretty much good. It will be more than 40 minutes when we finish. Now it's uh, 18 again and we already restarted camera once. So let me just wait till camera stop recording usually it's about a little bit more than 23 minutes and then we will figure out what to do and what will we do for next time and maybe a little bit more of the homework so let's for another two or three minutes we will place diamonds in here I still have a lots of diamonds on my tray so let's work it Sorry, have to stop the phone, phone, phone. I forgot to mute the phone. But anyway, I had to answer, so. Let's continue. So what I was gonna say, this donut looks like a white glaze sugar on the top. That have those whole bunch of different multicolor sprinkles. By the way, years ago, I made my own, my homemade sprinkles for the cupcakes or cakes. Do you know how to make them? If you want to learn, comment and I will create video for you. I still have some sprinkles because obviously it's a sugar. So it doesn't go bad. So yes, I used to experiment a lot by creating sugar flowers, fondant, all that good stuff that cost us a little figure change. <laughs> by the way, creating all these donuts, but I'm right now trying to lose some weight a little bit. Yeah, I pack over winter. Why not? So even first weekend at the campground, I managed to lose one pound. I know I will because I'm more active up there. And here I'm sitting home and I'm munching on some bakeries and chocolates and here and this and that. 
up there I more walk by the lake it's extra exercise and I don't eat too much junk up there so that's what is good about camping I feel more fit after season you know camping done I feel better because my legs getting stronger from walking through those rocks on the beach and swimming in the lake so that's a very good advantage you know to to be a little bit more healthier for the summertime and now of course i wanted to create this video for an extra two minutes till my camera stopped but because my phone was ringing now time is messed up for me so I guess let's just create a little bit more of this color okay I hope my camera is focusing I never kind of not looking on my camera I hope when I go with the pen, it doesn't go after focus for you. I don't know. All right. So anyway, let's let's zoom out a little bit because I don't want this to be super super long. We already chit chat and having a good time, telling the stories. Let's see what we created so far. I will try to zoom over a little. Okay, my tripod leg. You can see. Let me readjust a little bit camera like this way okay so you see an upside down but that's okay all donuts looks the same you know upside down or not and oh I can see now from far that even I put in here only white but it feels like already pink sprinkles in here looks so natural it's looks almost real that blue patch that we created in here I still don't understand what that is doesn't look like anything now mm, this donut looks so yummy we still have a missing the colors up there a little bit looks good looks good okay so my dear friend Heidi uh, and I can't remember who else. I hope you join us. Please comment if you did join us today for um, this diamond painting together. So if you pull out your diamond painting from your stash. So I can mention your name next video if you wish. And um, maybe uh, um, link it up uh, Instagram. So we will finish homework. It's a time for homework. So we will finish two colors, which is 20 and 22 symbols with this light color that we just did and um, dark, not dark, but blue that we were doing it. And it's not too many in here of this color. We only have in here, let me show you a little bit more on this donuts if I can curl up my canvas a little bit in here symbol G just a little bit and just like a one here one there and then a little bit more in in this corner a little bit so and a little bit on the edge in here so not too many of this color in here it will be very easy and fast to finish of the stripe symbol all this white that you see yes we will have lots of work to do to fill in our donuts icing this is icing on the cakes uh, we will finish this one and let's pick maybe one more color that we will do off camera and the best thing to do off camera it's something dark not very attractive and when I'm looking at right now maybe the symbol R it looks like it's going to be something brown and not attractive number nine let me show you what kind of diamonds that would be make sure if you have a symbol six and nine 
good tip for beginners always underline you see that so you know which one is six which one is nine so you don't mistake accidentally okay uh, yeah always underline so here it is we have for this one symbol R this brown color so why don't we finish this one color on our own and let me see if we, we can pick something else because on a camera I want to work with just like a gorgeous bright colors let's see what's H number 10 okay here's another brown so let's finish these two colors after camera for the homework what are you thinking ladies I think it'll be okay so it's a um, nine nine and ten okay it's easy to remember nine and ten and of course 20 and 22 that we work today so we will finish till next video another four colors that would be in total of six and let's see I was asking if my lovely viewer would pick her colors next time but looks like she wants to me pick but if you change your mind more than welcome to pick your own color but I think I will pick next colors for our next video so you can kind of prepare I see this beautiful stripy donut and Z 15 let me check oh look at this gorgeousness I think we should do this color next time this one and and yeah definitely this one 24 so we will go kind of like a, a family of mint because this one kind of like a greenish dark mint and this one looks like a blue on a camera but it's much more beautiful in person so this one will be for our next video when we will uh, diamond paint together and that will be next week so we have our homework homework and hopefully I will remember about this colors to work next time on it I will try to remember or I will have to look my video to remind myself what we're talking about because you know how many projects I do in one day I could be totally messed up well thank you so much that was fun 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 and this canvas always make me smile because when I'm looking on this all this gorgeousness it make me happy look at this here it looks like Hershey candy or something or maybe tiny mini marshmallows in here on the top I think it's a mini Hershey white chocolate in here on the top very look alike I think so all right so thank you for staying with me thank you for creating with me and uh, I will see you tomorrow as always every single day thank you for watching